Good morning, everybody. It is Sunday, June 4th, and I am doing a special Sunday edition of our incoming inventory lot walk. Uh, not because I wanted to, but because we had a Yukon, where is that? There it is, right to my, over my right shoulder there, that came in, got dropped off in front of the gates, and we had to uh, get in the building to get the keys, to move it, to open the gates, etc., etc. Fun stuff. Um, I made a short out of it. It's uh, called Dumb Things People Do. Anyways, go check that out. Uh, let's do the lot walk. We got a bunch of stuff in over the weekend, and some of the stuff I don't even know what it is yet uh, because I haven't looked it over quite yet, but most of the stuff I have. So let's get right to it. Uh, we did get this uh, truck in, and it's actually through the shop already, and I got a video up of that. That came in the other day. I don't think I, that was in my lot walk. It came in during the day. Uh, so that is a 2023 Chevy G3500 with a Bay Bridge uh, box on it, cube van. Uh, that's only got 1,600 miles. It's absolutely perfect. Uh, this is a 2021 BMW 440 Xi. We actually have two of these now. And this one is just the coolest color you've ever seen. Uh, it's got like metal flake in it. Um, oh yeah, by the way, grab your coffee if you didn't grab that already. But it's got some like gold metal flake in it. Really a cool color. Um, so that's going to be up for sale here. I think that's got around 20 some thousand miles on it. This is a Dodge Challenger. I want to say this is a 2011 uh, SRT8. This one has the stick shift. It only has 7,000 miles on it. And this color is called Green with Envy. It is also the same color as Mojito on the Wranglers. Uh, but we got this in, and it is absolutely perfect. This was a trade-in on one of our Sublime Green Hellcats. Anyways, uh, we got a 2016 Ford F-250 Super Cab Lariat. Uh, this one's in really nice shape. It's got a couple little imperfections but we'll make those nice and this one has 39,000 miles on it I've got a 2021 Bighorn night edition uh, crew cab Cummins diesel and uh, it's got a little bit of a leveling kit on it aftermarket springs and shocks and everything and that's a nice truck I think it's got 20 some thousand miles this is a 2022 Ram 2500 Laramie night edition and this thing is in really nice condition. Remember, all these vehicles are linked in the description below. And I think this has like 20,000 miles on it as well. Uh, we have not looked at this one yet. This was a trade-in. And we had to get it through the shop because we swapped wheels with the customer um, on accident. So we had to get the new wheels on here. But looks good. This is a gas 6.4 2022 or 2021. Uh, Patriot Blue, really a nice truck. It's only got like six or 7,000 miles on it. And this is the GMC Yukon that was blocking the driveway this morning. Uh, this is a 2019, 55,000 miles uh, SLT. You gotta love that they put the Chevy Z71 wheels on it and then they put GM stickers over the wheel covers. <laughs> Just a lot of fun stuff people do here. Anyways, I've got a Chevy Colorado. This is a crew cab. They say it's an LT4, but it's pretty base. Uh, this is a 2018. Uh, we gotta get that through, that just came in. I'm not sure on the miles, so you have to check the link in the description below. This is a 2016 Dodge Challenger Hellcat. Go Mango. It's got Moon, Laguna Leather. I believe it is a six speed as well, or is this one the automatic? This is the automatic, my bad. Uh, this thing is absolutely perfect, uh, really a hot car. I've got a 2014 Mega Cab uh, Laramie Cum Cummins Diesel Granite Crystal, and I don't know the miles on this one off the top of my head. I think it's got like 60,000 miles. This is a new Grand Cherokee. That is a new Ram Promaster. This is a Chevy Silverado crew cab. We took this in trade. Looks like a midnight edition or something. I have no idea the miles on it. Uh, you'll have to check the description once I make that. It'll be in there. This was also a trade-in late on Friday. This is a Cherokee. 
Um, don't know anything about it other than it looks like it's a limited. It's a 2021 and it's in pretty nice shape. It is a 4x4 and it's either a turbo or a V6. I can tell because it's got the dual rear exhaust. And this is one I just did a video on. This is a 2019 Ram 3500. Uh, that's pretty nice, 119,000 miles. It's got the ice in and everything. This is a ProMaster trade-in that we got. I have no idea what this is. There's no paperwork in it. Um, looks like it's in pretty decent shape though. And then here is another trade-in. I'm getting too far ahead of myself. Here is a Chevy Suburban that I took a video on on sun Saturday as well. This is a 2022. This thing is loaded up. It's got just about every option you could ask for. Um, there's a video on that, so check that link out. Same thing with this one. This is a 2020 Ford F250 Lariat Sport. It's the first Lariat Sport I've pretty much ever seen that has the Lariat Ultimate Sport, I should say. Um, really a hot looking truck. And then this is one that got dropped off. Uh, this looks like to be probably a 18 or a 19 and black FX4. What does the interior look like? Lariat. So that's a Lariat as well. No idea the miles. I apologize. Once again, you're going to have to check the links in the description below. And finally, we have a Hyundai Palisade that got traded in. I have no idea what this is all about um, other than it's a trade-in and really nice condition. So they'll be, they should all be live on the website right now. Thank you so much for checking out the Sunday edition of the Lot Walk. Um, remember to like, subscribe, and share, and click all the links below to get more information on each one of these vehicles that we just went over. Thanks again. Have a great Sunday.